Malachi, thank you. Breaking overnight, there are more accusations coming out this morning of abuse by a local church. It's the second part of a year-long investigation carried out by the Associated Press. The new report shows that at least a half dozen times over two decades, authorities re investigated reports that members of Worth of Faith Fellowship in Spindale were beaten. Former congregates say orders came down from leaders that they had to lie, and two assistant district attorneys and a veteran social worker coached worshipers and their children on what to say to investigators. One former member, Matthew Fenner, said he was leaving a prayer service in 2013 when nearly two dozen people held him captive for two hours, slapping, punching, choking, and blasting him to expel his, quote, homosexual demons. Um, had Matthew around the neck and would like lean him forward basically in half and then shove him back so hard that the chair would tip back and then as soon as he the you know force brought him back she bring him back again and then shove him back um, so at this point like Matthew's like he's like you can tell he's not really with it because he's white as a sheet and I was just like he's gonna die Five people were charged with kidnapping and assault, but no trial date has been set. The church founder turned down repeated requests to discuss the allegations against the church. But hours after the first AP stories were released last week, the church posted a statement on its website calling the accusations false and saying Word of Faith Fellowship does not condone or allow abuse in any form at 